sun's not here. Well guys, as you can see there's noise on the ground. I believe this is going to be my last ride of the season. The bike is gonna go on storage today or tomorrow and then hopefully it's gonna be a short winter and I will bring uh, my Africa Twin back on the street by March or at the latest April. Nobody behind. I had a sudden change of plans. I had packed my bags and I was planning to, I don't like this, there's ice everywhere and I was planning to ride a bike to Las Vegas, leave it in storage there, in fact I had already found a place, uh, stop in Moab and do a few of the national parks in Utah, do a one week trip before flying back to Las Vegas, flying back from Las Vegas back to Montana. Well, it didn't happen. Um, I don't know, I had a bad feeling about that, call it what you will. Uh, I woke up several, several times last night. And uh, wow, there's so much ice, I was not expecting this. I was not expecting this. Oof. Uh, so I had a bad feeling about that. I don't know what it was. Call it a premonition or whatever. I woke up about every hour last night. Uh, not just doubting myself about taking the bike but it was something, there was a voice telling me don't do it. So I decided not to do it. It would have been nice to have the bike in Vegas for the winter, uh, be able to fly down and, uh, and maybe do some trips. Uh, let's say, Maybe do some trips in uh, down the Grand Canyon or uh, Death Valley, place I've not seen yet. Do some videos for the channel. Well, it didn't happen, so I don't know. I don't regret it though. When you have a voice, an inner voice, so persistent, telling you not to do something, then I guess it's better if you don't do it. What do you say? Uh, let me know down in the comments if you ever had a feeling like that, like so persistent, not to tell you to do something or to tell you not to do something. Did you follow it? If you did, do you think you made the right choice? If you didn't, do you think that was the right choice? Oh my God. The road is icy. I do not like this. Uh, there's not much traffic. I was planning to go to to a little chalet down the road. Um, there's an unpaved road that goes there. It's almost a single track. Um, if there is so much ice here, the other road is going to be completely covered. These roads are always in the shadow. This one is paved. The other one is not. So ice is persistent on unpaved roads. We had so much snow last week. And even if the temperature has been in the 50s, as you can see, wherever there's shadow, there's also snow and ice. So let's play it safe. I don't wanna hurt myself on the last ride of the season. I pack my bag to go to the gym. We're gonna do that, gonna have a nice workout. 
We'll be washing the Africa Twin, polish it, and make it ready for winter. Hey, puppy. If you guys are still riding, if you are down south or wherever you may be, wherever in the world you may be, that allows you to ride, enjoy, safe riding to you all. Always stay safe. If your bike is already sleeping, well, find yourself something fun to do until you can bring your motorcycle back. And this is probably, actually no, let's say most likely, not going to be the last video of the season. It's only going to be the last motorcycle video of the season. Uh, as those of you who follow me regularly know, I am a photographer. So there are going to be many, many opportunities to do some photography. Maybe we'll do some night photography on the ice, in the snow and uh, get some nice clear starry sky or sunset sunrises are going to be beautiful with those alpine glows uh, maybe talk about a little bit of uh, photography technique if you're interested i hope you'll be here and you'll keep following me if you're not if you don't care about photography <laughs> um i hope you do well i hope i will see you again next spring and I'm going to wish everybody a safe, safe winter. Oh, by the way, today is November 2nd, so tomorrow is election day in the States. <sighs> I'm not going to get political, but I really, really hope that this country is going to turn for the best. It's honestly been a shit show so far. Uh, too many deaths, too many people suffering unnecessarily. Things are bad all over the world, I know. but. Politicians are there to make life better for everybody, not just about themselves. And I really hope that whoever will be president next year and the next four years will lead the country to prosperity for everybody, not for those people, not just for the people that voted for, for him. And this goes the same for every other country in the world. I wish everybody to have a good winter and a good year and prosperity. Thank you guys. I'll see you on my next video, hopefully soon. Take care, be safe. Please don't forget to click like, subscribe, and help me reach more, more subscribers. Thanks to everybody who helped me reach 200 over 200 subscribers in just in just a few months